Hey, Scorpio, let's take a look here and see what is going on with you guys in love. Let's see who's in your energy. Mm, okay, so you have someone that likes you. This could be someone new. You could be flirting with someone or there's this romance that is starting to blossom here. Gives me new energy, though, because it looks like someone wants to date. Let's see here. What is this? I like you for Scorpio. Ooh, stab in the back. Heartbreak. Separation. Okay, so Scorpio, this could be someone, um, I don't know. Now, with this stab in the back, this could be someone here who um, you ha had a start with. Okay, this person here still sees you as someone that they would like to date, but there's some type of heartbreak or pain, either from this person or you could be dealing with something from the past, some type of deception here from the past. Yeah, there was someone who was deceptive in this situation. So this could very well be um, a warning to not trust whoever a new person is because they're, you know, a hidden enemy here. You're about to find out something about this person or this is someone from your past wanting to come back around after they have already betrayed you. Okay, so someone here... Um, it's deceptive and you could be looking over your shoulder, the other woman. So this person here could have put you in competition with, with someone else. Or this is someone coming towards you that's new who you need to be careful about doing this, you know, this happening to you. Okay. Let's see. What's the message here? Scorpio. Y'all just came out on with it, huh? So you have a honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Okay, so could be two different people here. This new person here, and then you've got somebody else here that already, um, I'm here and snaked you out. They already did the mess. Yep, look, reconciliation is coming out. Yeah. And then you have trust. So there's someone here that you don't trust, Scorpio. And I feel that you're looking at this new person here. Um, yeah, because you know that you deserve love and then wedding and you want something long term and commit, you know, stable. So then as you are spending time with someone else, getting to know someone else, you do have this person here who stabbed you in the back, put you in some type of competition and something came out about this person. This person wants to come back towards you and try to start a new beginning, but you don't trust this person. Because you know what you deserve and this person is not going to give it to you, okay? With wedding here, you could be moving into a connection that leads to marriage because you got honeymoon here and you have wedding here. What's the message of love for Scorpio? Acceptance. Yeah, it's time for someone in this situation to accept that everything happened for a reason. And it could be time to move on because here and now your true love is already a part of your life. Okay, you have someone coming in. You have a twin flame situation here for some of you. This is a divine counterpart connection. So some of you have been dealing with your twin flame. For those of you who believe in that. Okay, go slow and back. Okay, so with this new person, you need to go slow and set boundaries. Okay, um, I feel like this is what you're going to be doing. You're going to be taking the time to get to know each other, spending time together. And setting firm boundaries because maybe with the person from the past, you did not set these boundaries. And that's why this person did what they did because this could have been a very shocking attack that this person, you know, had on you. This could have been something that you didn't see coming because maybe you were so open and vulnerable to this person. So now you know what to be careful about with this new person. What's the hidden truth message here? Just being near you is intoxicating. So you have someone who's a bit obsessive about your energy and they want to feel that way again. Yeah, this person uh, from your past, and I ain't going to say from the past because this could be a new person here too. This, this new person could be become, you know, very attracted to you, want to be around you a lot. But then you could also have this old person who's still obsessing over over you here yeah so many things remind me of you so yeah this person here that betrayed you is thinking long and hard about you now yeah mm. all right so we'll see what the tarot has to say for scorpio message for scorpio yep eight of cups you detached walk away from a situation here because something came to light here about what was going on with this person what else? Yeah, 
Someone feels left out in the cold. Eight of Pentacles. Someone's having some money issues. Five of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles. Someone's working on trying to get their money up because something they took some type of hit. Okay, maybe this person feels like you left them out in the cold, forcing them to have to really work on themselves or their finances or something here. Clarify that. Will of fortune in reverse. Yeah, someone's going through something here. It could be uh, about around their finances. Yeah. And then you got the chariot. So you're moving forward. You're moving forward quickly um, after releasing this situation. Okay, so it looks good. Oh, wow. I didn't see the six of cups here. Definitely someone from the past. And, um, I think you, it was right here on boundaries. So... I feel like you're going to have to set boundaries with this person, with this ex. Because this person here seems to come off as though they um, don't respect your space, your boundaries or something. Anything else for Scorpio? Anything else for Scorpio? Scorpio, I'm going to leave it there. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next one.